Today on mom to mom we are making a DIY pool noodle pencils. With our kiddos getting ready to go back to school, I'm sure you will find a very creative way to get those first day of school pictures. This is a super cute and inexpensive idea using pool noodles. If you can find a yellow noodle, great. If not, you can always just get a regular pool noodle and spray paint it yellow. Also, I want to note that pool noodles are kind of hard to find this time of year in the store, so you probably will have to order it online and have it shipped to your house, but still fairly inexpensive. You're gonna need some construction paper as well and some letters that you could use for poster board, tape, scissors, and hot glue. First, you wanna cut the pool noodle to however you want it. So you can do it to the height of your kids. If you have one that's going into pre-K or kindergarten, you can leave it their height, and then it's fun to see how much they've grown after the year, or if you want them to be able to hold it, you can do a short one like this. Then you wanna take your brown paper and kind of cut it just a little bit. Then you wanna take your permanent marker, make sure it's black and color one of the corners to create that pencil effect. Then you're going to roll it up, then take your hot glue gun and seal it. Then you're gonna take your red construction paper and kind of cut it all the way down to make the eraser. Then you hot glue that as well. Then you're gonna take your gray construction paper and cut that just a little bit smaller just to kind of create that eraser effect. Hot glue that as well once you get it into place. Then you can put your numbers or letters on there and then you have the perfect photo op for your kids on their first day of school. And I have to say, this one is a bit challenging, so you do have to have a lot of patience when you're putting it together and you might need to enlist some help. It's just a fun activity to grab your girlfriends or your kids to help you out with this project. And those photos, they last a lifetime. Moms, if you have any wonderful ideas for back to school, share it with us. You might see that on the next Mom to Mom.